Yeah, you don't need to worry about the items. Next. You know, for being on New Game Plus, I am getting bodied a lot more the than I thought I would be. Kill me. What was that? She turned into an other. How? Why? Those NDF soldiers must know something. I have to make them talk, no matter what it takes. <laughs> Where are you going? You can't run off during a mission. Let go! <sighs> Don't try to resist. I'm too strong for you. <sighs> huh. I'm impressed you're able to calm down so quickly. Why are you stopping me? For your own sake, and for Naomi's. So you know what happened to my sister? She metamorphosed. She can't change back. Not like this, anyway. What do you know? What I know is that the only way to make Naomi human again is to entrust her to them. I'm not even sure what happened, and you're telling me to trust you? You're not even sure what happened, and you're doubting me. I'm sure you at least understand that if you get Naomi back now, she'd just be killed as another. Is it really safe to let a mysterious group like that take her? That's the Seiron garrison of the National Defense Forces. They won't kill her. I can guarantee that. But don't ask me why they won't kill her right now. And don't notify the OSF command about the fact that Naomi has metamorphosed. Don't tell anyone about this. If you do, I can't vouch for Naomi's or your safety. Are you saying they'll kill me? They won't kill you. Your ride is here. Think hard before you act. Don't trust new Himuka. You'll regret it if you do. Ah, Shiden is sending a distress signal up ahead. You should help him. Major General Karin? Yuito and Gemma, you two take care of her. I'm returning to the front line to regroup the units. Yes, sir. Kasane, uh, where's Naomi? I suppose I can tell you, since you saw the whole thing. She was taken by troops stationed in Seiron. So that car was from the Seiron garrison? Yes, so? <sighs> Something's not right. When I reported this to Major General Fubuki, he told me not to tell anyone else, and to tell you to do the same. Major General Karin said the same thing. Why tell us to keep quiet? Does that mean OSF is hiding something? I don't know. Major General Fubuki said it would protect us. And take a look at this. It seems like the Seiron garrison dropped this, too. I remember seeing this at home when I was a child. According to the Major General, it's a drug that temporarily boosts powers. He wanted me to turn them over, but I managed to keep two of them without him knowing. That was a smart decision. In any case, why would something like that be at my home? The Randall family is involved in weapon development. Anything related to drug manufacturing would have only been joint ventures with Spring Pharmaceuticals. He also mentioned that this drug was classified information. It seems like the top brass of the OSF know about it. Spring Pharmaceuticals is Major General Fubuki's family company. Perhaps the commander knew because of that. Don't trust new Himuka. What? What is that supposed to mean? It's something Karin said. I'm not exactly sure what he meant by it either. 
If this ampule really is from Ceyron, then does that mean the Randalls and Springs are cooperating with Ceyron? Even if that's the case, it just leaves us with more questions. It might be best to do as we were told. We keep this to ourselves and look into it privately. That ampule seems to be pretty important. Might be a good idea to hide it. Then I'll hide the ampule inside Baki. Huh? huh? I didn't think you'd know how to sew. I was always told to be independent, never since I was little. Done. There's two, so who's going to hold on to them? I'll pass. I think you two should probably carry them. Baki... My sister would have been so happy. Kasane... About Naomi... I'm sorry. I knew that other was Naomi, but I was scared. I... I had no other choice but to fight. Hmm. Stop it. I'll get Naomi back. Just don't get in my way. This might come off as naive, but I want to do what I can to help save her, too. It is naive, but thank you. Oh, nice one, Sugumi. Looks like everyone's here. Huh, where's Naomi? Isn't she with you? <sighs> What's wrong? I'll tell you later. Uh, where's Nagi? And Captain Seto and Hanabi. Nagi is with the rescue team on the front line. Captain and Hanabi are totally fine. They're worried about you, so we should get out of here. No, the rest of you go first. She didn't supposed to be up ahead, so I'll pick him up. Then I'll go with you. For better or worse, I'm the leader of Kyokal Platoon until this mission is over. All right. Be careful. Are you all right, Kasane? After what happened to Naomi, you might not be in your right mind. I... I'm fine. I just have to help my sister. That's all I'm thinking about. Uh -huh. Yo, could be like, you take this bonky thing, but not my charm? I know. I know. Wait, how did Yuito get in there? I was looking at the member list. And it was just Gemma and Kasane, and then all of a sudden Yuito just plops up. Like the sucker fool he is. Fight. I know you're gonna give me one. This place is just too ominous. Oh, we finally found you, Sheedon. You're not hurt. Of course I'm not. Don't treat me like a lost child. That's what you looked like to me. You little... All right, let's go home. I'm ready to go, but where's Naomi? There was a reading around here that seemed like her. Naomi died. What? Kasane. What? I had to tell him. <sighs> you're right. Hey, was she really killed? I know you're cold-hearted, but this is too frigid. Why would I lie about it? Naomi is dead. Kyoka left me in charge of the platoon. I wasn't good enough and let Naomi get killed. That's not true. It was... That's just not what happened. No, it is true. I know words are never enough, but I'm sorry. Oh dear, you must be so sad after losing your sister. Kodama, what do you want? Are you looking for wounded? Shiden, you little traitor. You know I don't do menial jobs like that. Right. Well, the reason doesn't really matter, so I guess I'll just say you were attacked by others. 
Yeah, that sounds good. Okay, time to die. I'll just kill ya. What are you up to? Oh dear, you have enough time to talk? I'll have to give you more to deal with. Huh? When I said there was going to be a boss fight, this is not what I was expecting. That woman is impossible to understand. Is she actually trying to kill us? Wow, big talk from a traitor. You always were such a bad boy, Sheedan. Shut up. Just listening to you talk like that makes my skin crawl. <laughs> Thank me later. More power. Can you take it? Definitely was ready for that and just nothing happened. Easy. Let's go. All right, fine. Get lost. No way. I underestimated you. You're pretty good. What's going on? Why would you do something like that? Hmm. Well, I have my reasons. Okay then. Maybe it's time for me to get serious in round two. That's enough. Our mission isn't finished yet. Restrain yourself, Kodama. Major General Fubuki! Kodama, I'll take care of this. You don't need to get involved. Okay, understood. Gemma, Shiden, and Kasane, I know you're angry, but can you forgive Kodama for my sake? I don't mind. I'm not that angry. Aw, you're so sweet, Kasane. Now she hides behind Major General Fubuki. Hmm. Gemma, how about you? Understood, sir. All right. We're returning to the frontline base. I know you all sustained some serious attacks, so pull back and get some rest. Okay, I guess we should withdraw. Though I'm not sure I have enough in me to go straight back to Suo. Should we stop by the hideout? Yeah, Major Kyoko will most likely have the same idea. mission went really bad. Thank goodness you three are safe. No, I shouldn't be happy. I heard from Major General Fubuki. Naomi. She's dead. Yes. Damn those others. <sighs> Kasane, I'm sorry. I failed as a commander. She was such a promising girl. And now she's gone. Don't. She served like any other OSF soldier. If I believe what Karin says, Naomi is still alive. I don't know what he's thinking, but I have to leave my sister with those people for now. Wait for me, Naomi. I promise I'll come for you. Okay, so yeah, I, I, I would agree with you, Manadry. That was extremely random, and I don't really get why. Well, I mean, maybe, maybe we'll talk about it a little bit more here, but this definitely does feel like one of those situations where it's like, uh, we were just attacked by somebody that's a higher rank than us. Didn't we, uh, and, and you know, they were trying to kill us. Shouldn't we, you know, question that a little bit more? I assume that Kyoka doesn't know about Naomi's... 
metamorphosis. Should we keep her in the dark? We were told not to say anything, and it would only make her worry. You're probably right. Okay, let's save. That Kodama person is extremely random. I wonder if we're gonna encounter her again, cause... Are you okay, Kasane? I don't know what to say about Naomi. Just tell me if there's anything I can do. Don't bottle up your emotions. I yes, thank you. In Yuito's route, we met her once in a cutscene and then never you, saw her Kasane, again. Kasane, I heard about Naomi. I couldn't do anything to help and I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. It wasn't your fault. Okay. Uh, let's see. Why don't you attack us? Major General Fubuki seemed to know. Told her not to get involved, which means we can presume that Kodama was doing something unplanned. Find it's hard to guess, blah, blah, blah. So they, they talk about it here. So Gumi wants to talk or do a bonding event, and so does Hanabi. And Shiden does as well. I'm gonna be honest here. I know Sugumi is like the bomb diggity for a character, but I'm not really excited to do a bonding event with Sugumi as Kasane. I feel like it's gonna be incredibly boring, and uh, Anabi kind of strikes me as that as well. But like, I feel like most characters are gonna be pretty boring when it comes to Kasane's route, but we'll see. fast I didn't think you'd be here yet I just got here now come on let's order us a bucket of sweets mm, this is so good tea with sweets is the best way to relax I guess the tea and the cake aren't as good as what Naomi made yeah she was a good cook anyway other than how it tastes are you relaxing Relaxing? You're not relaxed? If there's something bothering you, you can talk to me. There isn't really anything. I'd be happy to take some fighting advice, though. All right, but are you sure you want advice from me? You were the best in the class. You're pretty good yourself. You're not great at focusing on the whole picture, but you're great in a straight fight. I think you could teach me about using my power effectively, or how to make openings on the battlefield. Uh, was that a compliment? Yes, it was. You just go right in, even if it's an obviously dangerous situation. Why is that? I feel like you're saying I'm reckless. But yeah, if I had to give a reason, it's because I trust my friends. There are other people who will watch the whole battle. Even if I am a little excessive and clumsy, someone will cover for me. <laughs> I guess I sound spoiled. I see. Trusting your friends. I'll keep that in mind. I suppose there are a lot of different ways to fight. I'm glad I could help. But that's not what I was asking. Aren't you worried about how you're getting along with people? How I get along? What do you mean? Um, well... Like if there's someone you like... Huh? I do like someone, but I'm not worried about it. Really? That's cool. Could I ask who it is? Sure. It's Naomi. Huh? Oh, um, I didn't mean like in a family sense. Like a guy or something. So you mean romance. 
You should have said so from the beginning. So... is there anyone? I... don't know. At least I've never felt anything like that. So there's no one that you like right now? I don't think so. I'd know if I liked someone like that, wouldn't I? What? Um, I think you can be attracted to someone without realizing it yourself. Really? Uh, Kasane? <sighs> I'm going to head back. Yeah. Sorry it got so awkward. It's not awkward. I don't know if it was relaxing, but I had fun, I think. I haven't had pointless small talk with anyone since I've been separated from my sister. Um, if it made you feel better, then I'm glad I invited you. Why do you care about me so much? Huh? We're friends. Of course I'd care. Friends? You mean me? Yeah. I think so anyway. Is that bad? No. I don't mind. I was just a little surprised. I just thought we were familiar colleagues. Colleagues? I would have hoped you at least considered us classmates. Well, we can say we're friends now. I guess we can. Thanks. Yeah, sure. We should have tea as friends again. Of course. I'll see you later. Not the start to a interesting conversation. But, but again, like, I was kind of expecting this to happen with, uh, with Kasane. She... Yuito just has one of those, you know, like, innocent but inquisitive personalities. And so, you know, he'll, he'll bring out some interesting stuff with the bonding events. But I feel like Kasane, you know, she's not interested in small talk. So she's just going to move conversations along in awkward ways. And that one was very indicative of that. Also, my bot is apparently losing connection and is having some problems. Because it keeps telling me. Oh, Kasane. I'm here, just like you asked me. What did you want to talk about? I was just wondering if you were okay. Me? I'm alright. Really? I mean, everything with Naomi. Oh, right. Now that you mention it, you were there too, weren't you? When it happened, you saw Naomi transform. Yeah, it was really scary. Just thinking about it upsets me. But I know it has to be harder for you. So... And that's why you reached out to me. Thanks, but I'm fine. That can't be true. You can't be okay. I didn't say that I wasn't in pain, but right now I have bigger priorities than my own feelings. I'm going to do what I need to for my sister. That's all. You don't need to worry about me. Okay. <clears throat> have you talked to my sister before? I mean, you're in different platoons, so I figured you wouldn't have interacted that much. We talked once in a while. Because we had common hobbies, like gardening. Gardening? I like growing flowers. When I said that, Naomi said she was interested as well. Flowers. Right. Naomi did like flowers. Not just flowers. She also said she wanted to grow herbs to cook with. Can you grow herbs on your own? It's not difficult if you know how to grow them. But it also depends on the variety. For example, mint is easy to grow, parsley and basil too, and you use them a lot in cooking. I see. There were some plants that like dry places, and others that need to be watered frequently. <sighs> Why did you get so quiet all of a sudden? I'm sorry, I realized I was blabbering. I wouldn't consider any of that blabbering. I studied a lot about herbs to teach Naomi, so I got a little carried away. I see. Thanks. You don't have to thank me. 
I just had so much more I wanted to talk to Naomi about. Whatever it was you were going to teach her about gardening, would you mind teaching me instead? What? Of course. Are you sure? I'm sure. You never know, it might come in handy. I also want to find out what my sister wanted to know. Okay. Just like with herbs, plants have all kinds of uses. I'm sure it will be helpful in your life somehow. Oh, I know. The lavender flower has a relaxing property. Drinking it in tea or smelling its aroma when you're tired or feeling bad will make you feel better. Thank you. I'll keep an eye out for some. Okay. Well, goodbye. She's so kind to me. I can tell she cares. And while her personality may be different, there's a part of her that reminds me of Naomi. Unsurprising to anybody. Sugumi. Sugumi just has a way of making things that aren't interesting more interesting. I I might uh I might give Sugumi's a second uh bonding event to see if it's interesting. Hanabi's wasn't very interesting at all. But then again, I don't think Hanabi's was interesting with Yuito either. Maybe that's just Hanabi. Also, I don't exactly remember Hanabi's. She was like worried about her her parents and her family name and like the OSF hospital and stuff. Uh oh. oh. All right. The moment we've all been waiting for. The Shiden Kasane bonding event. Shiden, can we talk? What do you need? I'm busy. There's something that's bothering me about your actions during our operations. <laughs> okay, Ms. Leader. Go ahead, say what you want to say. You fly solo too often during battles. From my calculations, you do this about 30% more than the other members. More importantly, there weren't many cases where it gave us an advantage. How about you coordinate with the rest of us? What? Did you not hear me? I'm suggesting that fighting individually doesn't play to our platoon's strength. I follow instructions outlined by the operation. Or is babysitting you guys part of the plan? I didn't ask you to babysit. Combining our strengths is a more efficient solution. We all have unique powers. Complementing each other with what we lack will help us fight more effectively. Our operations have all been successful. I don't see a problem. We could be stronger if we continued to train. Are you satisfied with our current state? You don't have any right to say that to me. I'll fight my own way. Stop trying to boss me around. This isn't an order, it's a suggestion. Are you all right? Do you have a problem with your hearing? What did you say? Now, now, you two, don't fight. We're all on the same team here. I only suggested she then cooperate with us more. Seriously? You were giving me a whole lot of attitude for someone asking for my cooperation. Okay, calm down, the both of you. Listen to me. Shiden, your fighting skills and analysis levels are excellent. We all know you're capable of working on your own. However, you're part of a team. Don't you think it's worth practicing coordinating with your teammates? It's not easy to adapt to a sudden change. So why don't you start by becoming friends with Kasane? <laughs> friends? Kasane, you've taken the initiative to think about our platoon. Our team will become stronger if we're able to coordinate well together. But just telling someone how you feel isn't enough to reach an understanding. There are many ways to communicate. Why don't you study the people around you and think of creative ways to do that? Creative? You're both good kids. I'm sure you'll get along. Do your best. 
I don't need friends. If I'm strong enough to fight alone, I can beat the others without having to rely on unnecessary coordination. That's fine with me, as long as you don't hold us back in battle. Are you saying I'm holding you back? Yes. First, you charge into the front lines alone too much. You lose sight of your surroundings when you get excited. <laughs> your overconfidence and poor follow-through are also concerning. You always lose focus and relax when you see victory at hand. I I'll do better on the next assignment. So you're aware of this. Good. Everyone has faults. As perfect as we try to be, we all have limits. That makes relying on your teammates a necessary strategy. Fighting alone will get you killed one of these days. Sheedan? He seems angry. Was I too harsh again? Are you mad? I apologize if I offended you. So you point out people's weaknesses in order to claim superiority? That's not what I do. It doesn't matter who's better or worse. Fine, be like that. But I'm never losing to you. I'll conquer all my flaws and weaknesses on my own. Now don't talk to me anymore. I've really made him mad. I guess this means I didn't come up with a creative way to communicate my thoughts to him. I'll have to work on that. I bet Naomi would be able to handle this without a problem. I have to figure this out on my own now. I have to think of a way to get along with him. That one... I think that one could be interesting, but... that It's really unsurprising because it's Sheedan. So confrontational and angry. Alright, let's save. Alright, so right now we're at a, a definite yes with Sheedan and a maybe with um, Sagumi. You don't look well. You've been through a lot, so rest a while. You can go back to Suo later. Gemma and I have to go back to file our report, but there's no need for you and Sheedan to rush. Don't push yourself, Kasane. Hey, if you're gonna rest, rest. I'll read a book or something. Why don't you go back to Suo with the others? It's my choice. Well, I'm going to rest then. How long are you going to follow me around? Sh shut up! I'll go then, if that's what you want. Garrison of the National Defense Forces caused a stir when they deployed unauthorized near the abandoned subway to invest. Chairman Sumeragi criticized the move as being outside the purview of civilian military operations and has ordered the Minister of Defense to find out the facts. From Mother? We heard about Naomi's death. Why didn't you tell us? Our sweet little Naomi... We couldn't refuse her desire to be a scout, so we left our precious girl in your care. I guess I was wrong to hope. We were fools. I don't want you contacting us anymore. You've never contacted us anyway, so I'm sure that won't bother you. Is that the Randall Industries logo?
That man was from Randall Industries, but there was something off about him. Where did he go? I've got a nearby resource reading. This, this noise needs to go away. Alright, it's gone. Thank you. So? Seiron's preparations are nearly complete. Everyone deployed in Suo merely await your command. The destruction of the OSF from within is progressing nicely. Half of them will align with Seiron. Then the rebellion will be carried out at Kunad. Wait. Did they see me? I knew you'd come. What's that supposed to mean? Just a sad, sorry fate. Who is that girl? Naomi's younger sister. I'll take care of her. Randall's adoptive daughter. Well, I must be going. You're planning a rebellion right in the middle of town? <laughs> I wonder how much you truly understand. What does that mean? What are you saying? You don't need to know yet. Come with me. Okay. Where am I? The GPS program isn't working. Is Sinet down? No. It seems this room is blocking the net. You're awake. Stay here and be quiet. I get it. Karin told you to watch me. That's why you wouldn't leave me alone. So you support the Seiron Rebellion as well? Seiron is my homeland. And Major General Karin appreciates me more than Major General Fubuki. Get out of my way. No. Then I'll just have to make you. Don't be silly. If you think you're good enough to fight me, hey, listen to me! I told you to wait! Do you think you can beat me one-on-one? -on -one? I do. Then let's see who's better. Right here, right now. Seems like I'm better, sucker. Check yourself. Don't resist. No way. You're all bark and no bite. Kasane, we're here to rescue you. Um, what's going on? Yeah. Shiden came to help me too. He got hurt. Don't worry about it. <sighs> I see. So will you help us, Shiden? Help you? What do you mean? My brother Karin Travers has taken his regiment and is trying to start a rebellion with Seiron. <sighs> I want to confirm. You know that my brother is in league with Seiron. Yes. Then, do you know where he went? He mentioned a place called Kunad. That's Kunad Highway. I'm going to go stop my brother. This is personal, so I can't ask the OSF to help. I'm going too. I want answers from Karin. Right. I can't let Karin do this either. Shiden, you'll come with us, right? I... Come with us, Shiden. You'll get what you want that way. <sighs> All right. If Kasane's going, then so am I. As your commander, I can't let you two go alone. Okay. We'll split the platoon into two teams. Luka, Kasane, and myself will go first. Kyoka and Shiden, you support us. That's best. Right, Shiden? Whatever. Hey. Okay. Things are escalating very quickly on this side as well. Although, at least we get a little bit of a lead into it. Whereas, 
with Yuito's route, it was just like, oh, he's a traitor and he's trying to kill you. And it's just like, what? Um, let me see, let me see. Let's say yes. Go down there. Innocent rabbit hug. <laughs> All right. A little concerned about giving Luca and Arashi these uh, these abilities, these priest weapons, because might come back to to bite me. Um, all right, we can go there. I'm thinking maybe I should go save first or something like that, but I'm sure there'll be a save point there, right? 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 This should be where um, we meet future Yuito as well. I'm very, very curious what that conversation is like. How did you know I had been imprisoned? I know of my brother's suspicious behavior. So I've been casually observing him. Which is why we were able to free you. But my brother likely suspected something like this. This is pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Get to ride the bus. Did my job. Means Yuito doesn't get all the fun. Okay. 
Okay. More stuff is gonna go down. Presumably. This cherry blossom tree. It is growing so wild. Like nature is trying to take the land back from humanity. Yes. It's very beautiful. You guys have a poetic way of looking at it. I'm just finding it hard to walk. Roots are in the way. This will be big. It's done. Follow up while the enemy is burning. Help me, Luca. Was brilliant. Uh, why don't you tell Luca? I'll be paying you back <laughs> with a stab in the back. It looks like I get uh, access to a couple of buses here. Access to that many buses. That's why we're forced to walk. The last time. Help me, Luca. But maybe they did. It is nothing. Got it. That was a nice move. Useless. It's over. Basically four hours right now. I could end this on a cliffhanger. 
think I'm gonna do that. <clears throat> this is where I'm gonna call it quits for today for Asane's routes. I will be back tomorrow, 7 a.m. Pacific, to continue with some more Scarlet Nexus. And, uh, you know, we'll hopefully get some... Some... Uh, I don't want to say context, but I want... I want more than a, like... Just a, a brief conversation that, like, oh, yeah, Karn's our enemy now, kind of kind of thing. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping... We get more elaboration. That's that's what I'm looking for. Anyways, I don't see anybody streaming, so I'm out. See ya the next time I see. Peace.